This is Honesty Hour? This is Honesty yes. Hour. I have never seen a single Twilight movie. No. You said this was Honesty Hour, and now I'm <laughs> I'm sensing judgment. Okay, uh, I'll be biased. I'll say Nayendra. I just I always loved her like as a kid. So maybe yes. this is more narrator for me, and just okay. like you know. Okay, like, that there. is a very good choice. That is very yeah. good choice. That, she was my childhood. <laughs> I love her. Yeah. So I'm gonna go Nayendra. <laughs> Hi, Maitri. Welcome to Painquilla. Uh, it Thank is you. so nice to see you because I just finished watching uh, the new season and I loved every minute of it. Like my Daisy heart was very happy. Uh, <laughs> the first question that I wanted to ask you, I know you must have been asked this a lot and it is the debated question. But are you team Edward or team Jacob? Wow! Okay, I see you. I was like, come on, you know this answer. You know what I'm going to say. Wow. Wow, that was good. I like that. That was really good. Uh, you saw my face there. You really got me. Okay, this is honesty hour? This is honesty yes. hour. I have never seen a single Twilight movie. No. You said this was honesty hour, and now I'm I'm sensing judgment. I am getting some Just severe very judgment. Tiny. Just very okay, tiny. Okay, that's, that's fine. I get that. I respect that. But that being said, I know that Jacob is the werewolf. Edward yes. is the vampire, a.k.a. Robert Pattinson. So I'm going to say I'm Team Edward because I'm actually okay. Team Robert Pattinson. I think he is a gorgeous man. So That is a good choice. I'm Team Edward as well. So we're on the same See? page there. <laughs> we, we came together in the end. I'm glad. I'm glad we I did. Know. <laughs> and, you know, shifting base to never have I ever. Uh, I think one of the favorite things for fans is the fact that it's John McEnroe who is mm -hmm. Davy's narrator. But if I had to give you a hypothetical situation where you could choose any Bollywood actor or actress to be Davy's narrator, who would it be and why? Oh, that's, that's good too. Okay, okay. <laughs> hmm. I don't know. It needs to be... I, I Maybe I'd want to switch it up to like a, like a female, like... Okay. Narrator. You know, let's get a female okay. voice in here. A nice one. Do you have any uh, recommendations? See, but these are just people I want. Yeah. These no, I people. want to know what you want. It's hypothetical. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I'll be biased. I'll say Nayendra. I just, I always loved her, like, as a kid. So maybe yeah. this is more narrator for me. And okay. just, like, you know. Okay, like that is a very good choice. That is a very yeah. good choice. That, she was my childhood. <laughs> I love her. Yeah. So I'm going to go Nayendra. Yeah. Okay. No spoilers, obviously, but a few refreshing Desi elements that were, you know, sprinkled across the entire season, whether it be fighting over not wanting the middle seat or, you know, <laughs> eating with your hands, both of which I'm very guilty of, by the way. Uh, was yeah. there any similar quirky habit that your family still follows? Hmm. That's a good one. That's a good one. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. I mean, see, this is the thing. They don't seem like quirky. Do you want the middle yeah. seat? I don't want the middle seat. I don't think Joe wants the middle seat either. Like, who wants the middle seat? That's weird. That's strange. I mean, no, not wearing shoes in the house, that's always a thing. But yeah. yet again, I don't want no dirty shoes in my house. That Do is white true. Why would you want Joe's? <laughs> the heck no way nah that's gonna be a no for me um i think in a i think in a scene i don't know if it like actually got cut if it's still in it or not but like we're just seen like packing all the leftovers into tupperwares yeah and i think i think that's like a south asian thing but like yet again maybe like a doggy bag <laughs> exactly but i mean like why would you waste food like exactly See, I just think all these quirks are just logical. They're just, they just yeah. seem like the right thing to do. So. <laughs> and, you know, shifting gears to a bit of an emotional side, but I think for a lot of us, when we found out that Never Have I Ever Season 4 is going to mark the end, all of us were very sad, but I assume for you, it was personally sad because you've lived at Devi for, you know, so many years. So how yeah. mixed are your emotions knowing that, you know, you have to say goodbye to that character? Yeah, it's... It's been a lot. Um, it's it is very emotional. Um, for me, the character lives on set when we're filming, and that's the fav like my favorite part of my job. I am very blessed 
to be an actress because I get to, of course, go to set, but I also get to do fun photo shoots, interviews like this, red carpets. <laughs> There's so many fun elements to my job, but my favorite part, without a doubt, is the filming. Like going yeah. to work at five in the morning to start filming, even though I hate yeah. morning. For some reason, <laughs> the only reason I'll wake up that early is for going to film. And we already filmed season four, so it's done. And I know everyone was like, oh, you'll be able to go do press, so it's not over yet. Yeah. But for me, emotionally, it feels over. Like, it feels done because yeah. I will never play Davy again. Like, yeah. I will talk about Davy. Um, I will get to do interviews and, you know, be with the cast who yeah. were their characters, but I will never get to play the character again. That day is already yeah. done, which is really sad. Thank you so much, Maitri. And Thank best you so of luck much. for the show and best of luck for the next season as well. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Thanks. Bye.